It's empty. He's not here. He's not in the car. You sure he's not in the car? Even with a fire that hot, there'd still be a body. He's got to be nearby. You really think he is here? He has to be. We have to start a search. We could use more men. Sergeant! I'm Detective Beckett, NYPD. The man that was in that car is one of our own. We need to scrub every inch of this area. I'll get my men on it. You have search and rescue dogs? I'll call them in. OK. I need to help them. You're no use to anyone dressed like that. We'll get started here, you go change. Come on, let's get you into some other clothes. OK, I'll be right back. All right, I'm going to search up near the road. Maybe Castle managed to bail out before the car crash. All right, we'll start on the car, see if we can tell what happened, where he went. All right. Airbag went off. It only activates when someone's in that seat, so your man was definitely at the wheel. Yeah, but if he walked away, where is he, and why isn't he picking up? Maybe his phone's damaged, or he's disoriented. I've seen it before. But if you left this vehicle, there's going to be tracks or a blood trail. Hello? Hey, Javi, walk to the back of Castle's car. What for? Just do it, OK? Check the pass in your rear side. Tell me what you see. Looks like it took a hit on the right side. Busted a taillight. That's because Castle got bumped by another car and run off the road. I got debris up here. All right, call local CSU. Maybe those pieces can help us ID that car. Detective, I think I got something. Tracks going from the car up to the road. Water wash part of the trail, but it looks like three people. Three people? That can't be right. See the two troughs in the dirt? Yeah. Made by heels from a pair of shoes. So he was run off the road, then dragged from the car. Castle got grabbed. 